Good morning, YouTube. Today, Hoovy is going to come buy our Ferrari FF. So, are you recording all of the nefarious activities? If you're new to the channel, my name is Dan, and this is my garage, and this channel is all about the supercar ownership experience. And yes, Hoovy is buying another one of our cars, so I think that means we've bought, we bought four of his, and he's bought two of ours now. So he's up on us two to one. All right, well, hey, at least we're making some progress in the right direction, so we're not, well, actually, to be fair, he's been giving us pretty decent prices, and we've basically broken even or made a little bit of money on all the cars we bought from him. Can't complain. So yeah, he's flying in later today, so I wanna actually give this thing a bath because it's been sitting in my garage for a couple weeks, and it's just filthy, and I just don't feel right selling a car that looks terrible. But uh, we've got a busy day today. We've got a lot of stuff we gotta do. We gotta run over to the new property, Gotta take care of some stuff there. We gotta swing by my storage unit and move some stuff out of there. I think we actually sold our lifts. So if you didn't know, I bought two lifts in anticipation of building a garage on my property. Well, that didn't happen. So we decided, you know what? Let's buy bigger lifts since we have more space. So we decided to sell those lifts. And wow, I, um, I underestimated how much people wanna buy a new used lift. Holy crap, I sold it in like, I sold both of them in, uh, I don't know, eight hours. It's pretty awesome. So those are gonna go, gonna go away. Uh, That's great. And then we got a lot of stuff to do on the property still. We still got to expand it. We gotta do a bunch of digging. We got all this other lawn stuff. It's just whew, so much work. And we gotta go by EAG today because, well, we've got some stuff going on there. I'm not gonna tell you anything about it until it's all solidified. So there'll be a video about it once it's all locked in place. So it's exciting, but I'm trying to just keep it on the DL for now. So stay tuned for all that. But take this thing and wash it and get it all prepped for Hoovy because well, it needs to look good. All right, just got done washing it and then rinsing it with the No Spots Pro, which we do sell. Basically it's a deionization water unit. Now this car has a really good layer of ceramic coating on top of a full PPF. So you can see the water is beat up really well. And this is why you love this because now I can just take my hand blower and watch. We don't need any towels whatsoever. We can just blow dry it. It's awesome. All right, YouTube, we gotta take one last drive in the FF to get gas because it's out of gas. Oh. Yeah, look at that. Uh, it doesn't even say it has any miles left, so it's very, very long gas. And I don't want to be that guy to Hoovy, where he's just like, oh yeah, hey, guess what? No gas. I know this is kind of like the grandpa's fright, but uh, there's a reason why this car is amazing, and here's why. <laughs> that V12. Oh, oh, that's good. There's no other four seat car on earth that is quite that awesome. I'm sorry, it's just fantastic. I know some people are like, oh, it looks weird, the crown shoe. Or, uh, I don't care, I love the look. I think it looks amazing, I, but I like hatchbacks. What can I say? All right, YouTube, we're in the truck heading to the shop and we got to hustle because I have an 11.45 lunch meeting with Chris and Josh and John and uh, we're gonna be discussing uh, some stuff with EAG and Normal Guy. Again, stay tuned for that. We'll talk about that as soon as it's all in ink. But uh, I have to quickly take a load of stuff. Just, I have piles of stuff still that I'm taking from my garage to the shop. We're on our way to the shop. Gotta drop it off, then hustle back home, then grab the BMW, swap the BMW with the Murcielago. Josh is gonna bring the Murcielago to lunch and I'm taking the Murcielago back because we're gonna try and take some pictures of the BMW so we can list it on Cars and Bits. We thought we'd give that a shot. Because, well, you know, it seems like a good car for cars and bits. I mean, it's a cool car. It's a BMW. BMWs seem to do well on cars and bits. Uh, that's the plan for right now. So uh, I'm trying to <laughs> trying to drive quick and I'm stuck behind slow vehicles. That's how it always is. All right, YouTube, at the shop real quick, dropping off stuff. And uh, it is quiet out here. That's one thing I really like about this place is, uh, is off the beaten path. Okay, yes, we got to move some shit in. And get out of here. All right, YouTube, we are in the BMW because we were supposed to swap it out for the Mercy. And unfortunately, the Mercy's battery was dead. So I'm stuck with the BMW. 
Uh, Hoobie is on his way to come get the FF. He just landed, so we are on our way back home to meet Hoobie, give him the keys, and hopefully he'll enjoy his new toy. I'm curious because this will be like the first car that Hoobie doesn't really have to do anything to. I don't know, maybe he's just gonna drive it and enjoy it. We'll see. So uh, I would definitely check out his video to see what he is gonna do because I'm curious. Deja vu. We keep, yes. we keep meeting I know. in weird places. I know. <laughs> but we were joking because I don't know, this thing's not broken. I, I mean, yeah. It probably usually, will break. We were just throwing turds at each other. Or actually, I threw a turd on you and you threw it back on me. And well, that, now we have. This is nice. legit. The car. Mercy was nice. This is. Nice. The Mercy's there's, fun. There's things in here. Oh, yeah, yeah. The, so the previous owner spent a ridiculous amount of money on the stereo. Okay. Like $10,000 plus. Dollars. I'm serious. Okay. I, okay. I saw the PPF, which is nice. It's full PPF. Yes. Uh, and it's been ceramic coated, so I, I washed it today. It was super, super easy to clean. I'm trying to think. It does have some sticky buttons going, but, you know, Ferrari. All right. Oh, watch your strap. Oh, thank you. But everything else is, like... These were the dumbest things I thought when they came out and so ridiculously expensive and now they've grown on me over the years and of course depreciation. Yeah, but, uh, the V12 shooting brake, it makes a lot of sense, but okay. I guess I was just salty because it was 500 grand and I thought I'd never be able to buy one. Well, you know? Yeah, let's say like the base price was like 290 or something like that and 280, yeah. so like option to anything it was in the threes or fours. Mm -hmm. But this is price-wise, it's not that far off from say like a 612 and I'd have this any day of the week. Oh god, yeah. yeah. Yeah, so. engine's way better, transmission's way better, it's more comfortable, more modern. It's just funky looking. I, I, people hate the shooting brake. I actually like it. Yeah. I don't know. You either love or hate it, but whatever. Well, the maintenance is a little bit more, but the transmission's already been done on this one. Correct. Yep. And you got the Kuyo, which I prefer over the regular tan. It's, it needs to be beige on the outside and this full grandpa spec Ferrari, you know? <laughs> full grandpa spec. <laughs> See, like my, yeah. It's gonna be a great road tripping car on the way home. You're gonna be comfy. Yeah. Oh yeah. Not so great on the gas mileage. Oh, I'm used to that. Yeah. Well. Yeah. But oh. I mean, six was it like 660 horsepower or something? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's hilarious. Oh, it's a great car. All right. Well. Yeah. I don't know what to do. It's auto hoopty. I'm just gonna daily yeah. drive it, take you the kids drive, around, yeah. all that stuff. Good to go. Yeah. Get the do so with the valves. Oh yeah. It's a boat. It is. It is quite large. You're you're gonna have to do like the Austin Powers 20 point turn to get out of my driveway. <laughs> I love this car. I'm gonna miss I, this is one that I'm actually gonna miss a little bit. Yeah. It was fun. The Daytona seats that are actually like Really cool, comfy, real comfortable. Oh, yeah. <laughs> See, that doesn't have massaging seats. That would have been love. ideal. Well, but enjoy. No control, right? Uh, not no. They don't do that yet. Ferrari doesn't. Well, it was an option in these. Oh really? But you know, it was pit speed, not cruise yeah. control. And then this could have had the passenger. Yeah, the screen. Right? Yeah, but instead it's got a little tiny panel. <laughs> 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 so you can put. Like a uh, tic tac, <laughs> just one. That's the, that's the solution. That's the hole to know that you're, yeah, you're buying an FF, but you're too poor to have your passengers see how fast you're going. Right. Yeah. I didn't want to spend the extra like seven thousand dollars, so here's a little tiny tic tac holder. <laughs> All right. Well. I'm surprised they even put some there and not just a blank panel. That's amazing. All well, right. Well, enjoy. Later. Drive safe. Thank you. I'm sure we'll see you again soon. Yes. Oh, look, it hands you your seatbelt. Oh, that's like an old Mercedes. Yeah. That's nice. I'm sure that's going to be expensive when it breaks. Yeah, probably. Yeah. About your lawn. Oh, it's got a long nose. Holy oh, God. yeah, you're already in the grass. <laughs> Sorry. Don't worry. You're good. You're good. Probably going to go in the grass again, but this you're... This mine, honestly. There you go. Bye-bye, FF. <laughs> Alrighty, one less car. Sweet. Oh wow, I guess the BMW gets to live inside tonight.
Good for it. It deserves it. It's been outside this whole time. All right, YouTube. Busy day. Lots to do. Lots got done. That's still for sale. BMW 650i. I think it's a 2014, like 47, 48,000 miles on it. I actually drove that car around a day, all day today. I love that car. I think it's fun. It's really comfortable, very powerful, and it's under $30,000. That's pretty sweet. Uh, GT500, got some stuff for it, but again, we're kind of waiting for the shop to get situated. Uh, it is for sale as is. Otherwise, we're going to try and do some more mods to it and then you know, see if we can pump up the horsepower a bit and play around with it for a little bit before I sell it. But oh, that's gonna do it for this video. I am exhausted. I've been running around all day today. So we'll see you guys in the next video. It's gonna be sweet.